Okay, welcome. In this video, I'm going to show you how you'll be able to start earning money using Warrior Plus platform using affiliate marketing business model. So this video, I'll go through step by step on exactly how Warrior Plus works. And I'll also show you how you'll be able to withdraw funds after you've generated that income. And if you're not familiar with affiliate marketing at all, it's simply you're just promoting other people's products and services. And when you convert their product for a sale to the customer, they're going to pay you a nice, healthy commission for doing that. You don't have to worry about making the product. You don't have to ship the product. You don't have to do anything uh, physical. You're just promoting. You're the middleman. You're promoting someone else's product service. And when that sale occurs, you're going to get your commission for it. And Warrior Plus is the platform that has the database with all of these digital products. Okay, so the first step is simply going to whatever browser you're on and you're going to go to warriorplus.com. Okay, and it's going to bring you directly to this page right here. And once you're on here, you're going to go right up to the top here and click the free sign up. All right, you're going to select a username, a password and an email address. All right, and make sure you use a real email address that you have access to. All right, so I already have a Warrior Plus account, so I'm not going to create another one, but simply select username, password and email and click on the I am not a robot. And then you're going to click create account. And from that point, you'll have your Warrior Plus account set up 100% free. Okay, now once you sign up and you log into Warrior Plus, you're going to immediately be sent right to the dashboard. And there's going to be a few things listed here. All right, right on the top is going to be an option, a drop down menu for marketplace, vendor, and affiliates. All right, so but scrolling down the page right here, you'll see different, different offers um, that's available. There's a whole lot more in the marketplace, but these are the ones that are highlighted on the, in the dashboard area and you can scroll down and see a few of those as of right now it's considered the top products as of today you can switch it to yesterday last seven days or even the last 30 days you know if you want to see which product have been selling good and converting over a longer period of time and one thing to take notice here is when you see these products right here you're going to see these icons next to them all right. And these are just different awards. OK, and this will tell you how great these vendors actually are because they've received these awards for having good products where people have made money. It's con their conversion rates are pretty good. Um, you know, the return rate isn't isn't is real low. All right. So as you can see, like this guy, this profit lens right here. All right. They've got a few awards. Top five percent vendor, superstar vendor, top one percent. Super affiliate then has made 34 featured offers. That's just one of the things to look out for um, when you see these different uh, vendors. All right. You know, if you're going to be promoting something, you want to be pushing a product that, you know, is created by someone that is known to provide value and has a valuable service product to offer. OK, so, for example, let's say if we clicked on one of them, one of these links right here. All right, it's going to take me to the actual sales page for the actual for this digital product. Okay, and I'll be able to scroll through. All right, I can check the sales page, the VSL and go through everything. And and once you go through a good amount, you'll be able to tell why certain products convert much better because the sales page, the copywriting is just up to par and it's better than a lot of other products. This is just an example of what one of the sales pages uh, would look like, but this isn't where you go to to actually uh, create your affiliate offer. All right, so if we go back here to the dashboard, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go up top here to where it says affiliate and we're gonna go down to the offers tab. Okay, now once you're on this page, this is actually where you're going to be able to find all of the offers on the Warrior Plus platform. If you look right here, it's showing 50 per page and there's over 10,000 different offers to choose from. Just break down a few things you should be looking for when you're actually choosing a particular product. All right. So if I start scrolling down here, you'll start seeing the offers pile up. You'll start seeing all the different offers I have them listed with different uh, categories. OK, so, for example, this first line right here, you'll be able to see 
the launch date of the actual uh, offer. Here you'll be able to see the amount of sales that have been generated. Okay, so this chat GPT empire has generated over 3000 sales and it literally just launched uh you know about a week ago you know about a week and a half ago so that's pretty good it's going to show the conversion rate uh 14 percent of the traffic that they're sending to them is converting into an actual sale which is a good thing okay then they have the visitor value and then they also have the average sale now the average sale is dependent on the type of offers and upsells that each individual product has at $22 average sale is probably not just on the front end of the product but they do offer some upsells i'm sure and that equates into the average sale per item and one of the most important features to look for is this box right here all right because it's one thing to have a great product that's converting pretty well right but if there's a lot of refunds that's going to be an issue because with warrior plus they do have a 30-day hold before the payout period um, then they do that mainly because of refund. Those commissions will be taken out right before it's even paid out. Right. So, you know, with, with me personally, I'm always looking at the percentage, the conversion rate, which is that's real important to me. Anything from 10 percent and up is is OK. It's pretty good. All right. The higher, the better. Of course, I tend to stay away from anything that's over 5 percent refund. For example, if I scroll down right here. This product right here has a 9% refund rate. All right. So a product like that, I wouldn't, um, I wouldn't do. Okay. Now, after you've gone through the different products and you see the one that you're interested in promoting, uh, now one thing with warrior plus is that you can't just select the product and then get your affiliate link and start promoting it. Okay. You have to actually request to, you have to actually request to be added as an affiliate to these products and i'll show you exactly how to do that right now okay so for example let's say i wanted to promote this high ticket ai i'll click on that right and it'll take me to this page right here and you'll be able to see different qualifications of the actual vendor all right you'll see who it is you'll be able to see the awards that they've got all right this vendor has had 91 featured offers so just looking at that i can tell that he creates great digital products and that would some that's something that i would be uh interested in all right so two things here i can open up the sales page and i'll open it in, in a different window once you go here it'll be pretty much show me the exact sales page that's going to be on my affiliate link when i get approved for the offer and uh, the site is real clean branded well just by going through this i won't play none of the videos or anything like that but but yeah i can tell why this converts pretty pretty well plus ai is real real hot as of right right now all right so that's the sales page you can go there um but right here is where you're going to request approval for the actual product so you can click on that right there i've been doing this for a while you know i've made sales and generated a good amount of money from affiliate offers so generally when i put in to request approval for a product um since there's actual conversions and sales history on my warrior plus account i'm usually approved within 20 to 30 minutes all right sometimes even faster now if this is your first time ever creating a warrior plus account the notes that you leave here does have to be a little more informal to get approved me personally i can put one sentence just letting them know that i'm, I'm i want to promote their product and like I said, based on the history of what I've done on Warrior Plus, 99% of the time, I'm just automatically being approved. If you are brand new, you do have to give a little more detail and pretty much just give them a give them a straightforward idea based around how you plan to promote their offer. Now, I'm going to show what ex pretty much the exact script that I used to use when I was new and was first trying to get offers. All right. So I'll copy and paste this right here. And simply, I would love to promote your product on my YouTube channel and my Instagram account that has over 47K followers as well. I have a following entrepreneurs. I have a following of entrepreneurs that can definitely use this service. So, of course, you can, you know, you can take a screenshot of this and make adjustments. If you don't have a 
Instagram or YouTube channel with thousands of subscribers or followers, you can, you can leave that part absolutely uh, blank. For example, I could scratch out this part right here. I would love to promote your product on my YouTube channel and Instagram account as well. I have a following of entrepreneurs that can definitely use your service. And then once you do that, you just click the request offer button. And just like that, it'll be sent over to the vendor. You don't have to overthink it. You know, you're just giving them a general idea of that. You know, you actually are an mar online marketer and you're telling them, okay, I'm going to use my YouTube channel or my Instagram. You don't have to give them the handle. They're not going to, you know, you don't have to send your YouTube channel. So even if you have, so even if you have just 10 subscribers on your YouTube link, you don't have to send them your link for them to even know about it. Once you do have some results on your Warrior Plus account, you'll be approved uh, even quicker. But even starting off, they are pretty fast. So usually within 24 hours, you'll get an email saying that you've been approved and it'll give you a link to where you log in and actually get your affiliate link to start promoting the offer. And it's really that simple to request approval for an offer. All right. You know, if you go back to go back to the offers and find another one, find another one that I like, I can hit request and say request approval and literally copy and paste the same exact message into there. All right. And also when you go to the vendor page of the actual product that you're interested in, Another great thing to look at is the actual funnel map. All right. As I was mentioning before, when I was talking about the average cost per conversion, I'm um, being involved with the upsells. When you come to the vendor page of the product, you can click on this tab right here called the funnel map. It'll pretty much give you an outline of what the actual funnel looks through the whole process from the customer's end. So for example, it's leading the customer to the main sales page. All right. Then there's additional upsells depending on what actions they take and then other upsells along that way and this is how they come up with the number of how much can be made on actual conversions it's dependent on what the customers do along the funnel process they might come in on the initial product which might only be 13 dollars. then once they get through that they get led to another upsell page which might be a, an additional add-on for an extra $10 or $5 or whatever the case is. And then they go through the whole entire funnel until they get to the final upsell, downsell page. And trust me, you will be surprised on how many times you send someone to an offer and they might end up getting two, three, or even four to five upsells along the buying process before they even get to the final uh, checkout screen. So these upsells definitely can boost your commission rates. You just have to focus on getting the customer to the front end of the actual funnel. All right, so if I go back to the offers page and scroll down, you'll now see that the a few offers that are pending. Okay, so now I'll let you know that you've actually sent a request, an offer to the vendor to be able to promote their product and it's still on the request. All right, now if I go to the top right here, I can actually change this screen from all offers to approved only. If I click on that, it'll give me the actual list of the offers that I'm already approved for. And these are the ones that I can actually already get a link for and go out and start promoting and, and making some commissions from them. And then if I go and go here, I can check all my pending offers. All right, and these will all be probably approved before the day is actually over. You know, if I go back to the approved, the orders, the offers I've been approved for already. All right, if I just go right here and click on get link, I'll have my affiliate link right here. And this is the link I would use while I'm promoting to send customers directly to my affiliate link and be able to earn commissions from the conversions, right? And actually copy and paste, copy this link right here and go to a new browser and you'll see it goes directly to the landing page for that offer. Okay, and this is exactly what the customer is gonna see, but it's an affiliate link, so it's coded to me. So any transaction that happens on this link 
is directly attached to my Warrior Plus affiliate link. So, so I will get the commissions for any purchases made on that affiliate link. All right, so now you know how to find the offers, how to pick the right offers, how to request approval for the offer, and how to find your link for the offer. All right, now I want to get into, you know, once you start generating these sales, you're going to have to be, you're going to want to be able to pull out your commissions. All right, so I'm going to show you exactly where you would go to to actually withdraw your commissions. All right, so that process is real simple. What you're going to do is you're going to go all the way to the top and you're going to see your username in this red area right here on the top right side. And you're going to see where it says W plus wallet. You're just going to click on that. Now, once you're here, the only requirement of getting your commissions is you do have to add a payment method. So there's PayPal, there's Stripe. Um, I think those are two that majority of people um, use. Majority actually use PayPal. Me personally, I prefer using Stripe. Um, but you can also have it sent directly to your bank account. It all depends on what works best for you. And, you know, depending on what country you're in, there might be some different options available as well. Since I personally have a payment method already attached, it's not going to ask me. But if you haven't done any of that yet, made any withdrawals as of yet, or connected any uh, payment processor yet, it'll ask you to add one and you can make the selection of what you want to use. All right. So as you can see, I have $370 pending as of right now, um, but there's zero available as of right now. Okay. As I mentioned earlier in the video, when you start earning commissions, there is a 30 day period. There's a 30 day pending period before you can actually cash out mainly because of chargebacks. If you sell a product, somebody ends up doing a chargeback. Warrior Plus wants to make sure that it's a clean sale and customer got the product and then just return it. The funds are going to be pending and when it clears, you'll see your current balance raise and that's when you can go to withdraw those funds. Simply when you do have a current balance that's already been cleared, then you would just go to the withdraw tab right here on the left side. Click on that. And as you can see, I already have my Stripe account attached and I can withdraw the amount. So it'll show the available balance and then I can mark it up to whatever I want to withdraw. And as you can see on the bottom here, you do need a minimum withdrawal amount of at least $10. All right. So this is a simple way how you withdraw your funds. Okay, so now that we got that out the way, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show my main resource of what I do when it comes to promoting these affiliate offers and just pretty much a way on how to get ahead of the curve and get in front of the offers before other affiliates are able to benefit off of it. Okay, so what I'm going to do is go to another website, which is called MunchEye.com. Now, this website is basically like a launching announcer which lets you know which big products and major products are about to launch in the market so if i were to scroll down you're going to see two sections here big launches and all launches and the main thing to watch for is right here where you're going to see w plus which means the product is going to be actually launching on warrior plus's platform so you'll be able to get access to it the most powerful part about this is these are products that haven't even launched yet. All right. So it's not on the marketplace. Nobody's promoting it. But once it does launch, there's going to be people online ready searching for it, trying to get their hands on these products once they launch. Once these major products launch, people are going to automatically go to Google and start searching the actual name of the product. All right. Now, if you're ahead of a curve, and you've got content, you've made a review about the product immediately while it's launching. You're going to have major access to a lot of the traffic because your content is going to be listed and coming up real early before a whole bunch of other affiliates get their hands on it to put out their reviews. All right. So, for example, let me just look up one of these right here. The Empire article bundle. Go to YouTube or Google and Type this in the search by article bundle review. All right. And as you can see right here in the top spot, and this was posted two days ago, there's someone that made a review 
about the Empire Bundle article. You click on the video. If you look right here in the video, it states right in the title that it's not launching until January 20th. So this was posted two days ago. He was able to get in front of the traffic and be able to get his review up before the product actually launches uh, later on. It just passed. It's 12 o'clock at night right now, so the product will be launching uh, later on today. Okay, now the review process is real simple. Okay, you're just basically just basically mentioning some of the features and on Warrior Plus you get access to the back end of the product so you're able to show people the sales page, you're able to go through the benefits and if there is any bonuses the vendor gives away as well. So you're just making a quick short uh, review video about the actual product. Okay, now this can be done on YouTube. You can write blogs, articles about the actual product, but YouTube is definitely uh, the quickest way to get in front of the, the traffic uh, as quickly as possible because once these products launch, these major affiliates send out the emails to their subscriber list and people are running to Google and YouTube to try to search and get some more further information about the actual product and if you come back here to munch.com and scroll down you'll literally see there's there's literally products launching about every two to three days there's definitely a lot of content and different offers that you can create content for and have it running on youtube okay and of course there's seo involved in whatever the case is but once you get these videos start ranking all right, you can literally make passive income because all you have to do is create these review videos one time and it will continue to live on YouTube for people that are searching for the actual product on a daily basis. Okay, now since these products aren't actually launched yet, you know, it's a little different process as far as requesting approval to get access to the products, uh, especially on an, early, on an early basis. All right, so let me go back up and Go back to that same offer, which was the Empire article bundle. Now I click on that and it'll take me to the JV page. Once you come onto this page, you definitely want to snatch this JV page link and keep that, that in a place where you will be able to find it. All right. For when they do actually launch. All right. So, you know, you can keep it in a notepad or however you, uh, hold your wherever you stash your documents important documents at for product launches and post the product and post the link right here and the name of it was empire article bundles All right, so what I'll do is I'll go to the sales page. Scroll down. And I'll be able to see exactly what the sales page for this particular product will look like. All right. And if I go back right here and I go to the actually that JV page link. All right. Right here is where I'll be able to put in a request for the actual product. Click on that. All right, and similar to what I explained earlier in the video, okay, you're gonna use a simple, a simple message stating how you plan to promote the affiliate offers. All right, now once you do get access to start promoting the product, you're simply gonna make a review video over on YouTube, all right? So, you know, if you've never done any type of review videos for YouTube, you know, you can definitely go on YouTube and look at other affiliate marketers on how they make their reviews. All right. They're simply going through the actual sales page of the uh, product. They're going over certain parts, certain features. You know, they may highlight certain parts that um, appeal to them. But, you know, you want to be real. Right? You don't want to guarantee, make any guarantees that a person can make this amount of money, that amount of money. I personally have four different channels that I promote affiliate offers that I do these videos for, these reviews, and and customers just want to know the truth. You know, don't try to overhype anything. 
and don't make any claims that you can't back up. You know what I mean? So I'm more pushing them on the actual value of the product and what it can do for them or where they can help their business or whatever the case is. But I'm letting them know, you know, if you see screenshots on the sales page of customers making thousands to millions of dollars or even the testimonials that you see on a lot of these sales pages aren't real. So, um, you know, I just like being real with the customers and you find you'll find over time that they actually respect that and they'll be more trustworthy of taking your recommendation on a product if you're not just selling them dreams and selling them hype and you're being real with them. Basically, that's the simple process of how I do the review videos. Of course, drop in the affiliate link in the description area and making sure, sure I give the customer a call to action in the video, letting them know that they can click the link in the description to get the product for themselves. All right, so if you got any type of value from this video, make sure you subscribe, like, all right, drop any comments if you had any questions. All right, but make sure you subscribe because I will have other marketing methods that I use to promote these affiliate offers coming up. So stay tuned in and I'll catch you on the next video. Peace.